Hey, welcome back to Cool Kids Art, and for this video, I will be drawing Beppy the Clown from the game Cuphead. So let's get started with a quick sketch, and then I will show you step by step on how you can draw this. All right, so let's draw this clown here, and to start off, we're gonna draw off his brow first. So we're gonna come in and just kind of make a little V shape like this, and then we're gonna give it some thickness. Okay, and then from there, let's draw, start drawing his face. So we're gonna come down like this, okay? And then we're gonna, from this line right here, we're gonna come down. That's actually the, his costume is half, half. And then right here, we're gonna draw his nose, okay? Now we can go up. Now we're gonna stop there because there needs to be a hat. So let's go back down here and finish off his eyes first. I do a curve there. And then other side here. Okay. And now let's finish off the eyeball. Curve, angle, curve. Curve, angle, curve. And then let me fill it in real quick so that it won't look so creepy. Okay. And his lashes, we gotta give him three lashes on each side. One, two, three. One, two, three. Okay. So from there, now we can draw his hat. Just make a curve like this. And then smaller one up here. And then same size on a little bit higher. Now we're gonna connect these. And now we're gonna draw the opposite curve on the other side. Same thing here. So now we have a hat and somewhat in uh, perspective a little bit, right? And right here now we can finish off his costume, just go straight up. That's kind of like the center. Okay, so from there, let's move on to his mouth. Um, so right here, just curve it all the way down, all the way across to his eyes and then come straight down. Just kind of curve it up like that. Okay, then from there, let's draw his teeth right here. Same curvature as that, that's this line here. And now, right here, just go straight down, close it off. And then, this bottom teeth right here. Okay, so once we have this, and now we can draw in some of his teeth. So there's maybe four lines on top, and maybe just two on the bottom. And now let's do his tongue. One curve there, another curve, goes all the way back into his mouth okay so now we can draw the back of his head so let's from his hat kind of continue this curve right let's come straight down and then we're gonna start curving out same thing here from his let's draw his chin just curve it in close it off for his neckline okay so right here this thing around his neck one curve there, and we're gonna draw the same curve on. Okay, now connect them. And then now we can draw the opposite curve on the other side. Now we got this thing going around his neck. Okay, so from there, let's draw right here. His neckline coming straight down, we'll continue that curve. Just come down a little bit, that's part of his body now. But we're gonna draw his, his arms first right here, so from here, just continue this. Just go all the way out, okay? So it's pretty far out. And then once we have that, now we can draw his hands. So we're gonna draw, let's see, let's go down like this. And now his thumb, okay? And this finger on the top, okay? So now we're gonna draw his palm. So there's two curves right here, one, two. And then we're gonna draw the pinky. And let's draw a line here. We'll close it off. That's for his palm. And then now we can draw the finger, the middle one. Okay. And then from there, let's draw his cuff. Well, actually, no, we have to draw his bottom and finish up his arm first, right? So just go all the way across, parallel lines. Now we can draw two curves. Close it off. And then the cuff would actually, would actually come. Let's do a little curve like that. 
close it off because it's a little cylindrical shape there. Okay, so now let's draw the other arm. So right here, right around his neck right here. One big curve like that. And then from his chin, do a parallel curve. So same thing here for his, for his hand on the bottom. His right hand, curve, his thumb, his finger up top, and then his palm, two curves. Finger, close it off, and one more finger, okay? So now the cuff, same thing, we can draw, let's see, curve here, curve here, and then we'll curve it in a little bit, draw a little line there. It's a little bit hard to see, I mean, it's just, there's a cylinder down there for his cuff. All right, so now we can draw, let's see, we can draw his legs first before we draw the rest of his body. So from here, we're gonna go straight across, diagonally, almost to right around there, to his neck. And then we're gonna come straight down, big curve, okay? And then right here, put a little dot, line, come straight down, close it off. Now we have his leg. And then we're gonna draw this little detail here, it's gonna flare out. Now let's try shoes, back, and then we're gonna draw kind of like that, almost like a sled. And then we're gonna come down, one, two, and then one big. Okay, so now let's draw in this other leg. So right here, we're gonna come straight down. So all the way down past his arm, past his fingers a little bit. Then we're gonna curve it in. Now we're gonna connect these. Curve like that. Same thing here, let's flare it out. Now same thing here, it's almost like a slit again. Okay, but slightly different. This time we're actually seeing the bottom of his shoe, so we're gonna go curve like that. And then we're gonna go one, two, three. Okay, now let's put in some of his details on his clothing. We almost forgot about this. All right, so we, there's a lot of little, just kind of zigzag it around. Okay, zigzag, 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 zigzag. All right, and then for his clothing here, um, it's, it's two colors, so this is the dividing line. So we're gonna draw from here, just go down there, and then just follow this, this outer curve here and just draw that. And then same thing here, we're gonna go all the way down. Okay, and then there's two diamond shapes here. Just like that. And that's it for this Beppy the Clown from the game Cuphead. I uh, hope you guys like it and if you do, please do give me a thumbs up and check out all my other videos and don't forget to subscribe. I will see you next time.